Hello, family and friends. Welcome to day 13 of my first R. Epoch treatment to battle um, large B cell aggressive lymphoma. Let's get into status. All right, eating, nauseous, not really today, a little bit, but not too bad. Mouth pain, a little bit, not too bad. Weight, I'm holding steady, I'm happy about that. Fluid, I accomplished my 80 ounce goal. Sleep, only six hours and 39 minutes. Had a couple of interruptions and I had to get up for a doctor's appointment. So I'll probably be going to bed a little early today. No naps, I'm holding okay. Uh, chemo, no, nothing significant as far as symptoms. With the exception of the hair. <laughs> I'm blessed with a lot of hair, so therefore you guys can't tell yet. Uh, but I shower last night. Shower there was hair with every uh, every wash. I guess I'll say every time my hands went through, I pulled out hair. So it's definitely, and I can feel some tingling on my scalp. So it's definitely we're definitely getting close to the. It's all going to come out. I'd say within the next five to seven days is my guess. Um, no big deal. It is what it is. All right, brain. I watched yesterday's video when I was editing and it looked pretty good. I'm gonna go with chemo brains in pretty good shape. Not a lot of slurring and have the right words most of the time. I'm going with chemo brains in good shape right at the moment. Movement, I had 7,000 steps. I only did one sun salutation yesterday. I don't know, I just wasn't feeling it, I guess. <laughs> Doctor. So I did go to the doctors this morning. So I have a little bit of doctor's news, nothing real significant. Um, oh, and my vitals were all fine. Um, doctor news. I reported the heart rate elevation. He said he didn't know what that was and he's not worried about it. So we're just going to leave that alone. I'm going to not worry about it. Um, the current plan is for four to six treatments. Right now I've had one. Next one is scheduled for the end of next week. So we'll see how all that goes. Um, that seems to be somewhat dependent on my response to the medication. Like how my, um, like how is my body tolerating it, and then also dependent on you know have we killed the cancer or not. So we are going to try to do a PET scan after the second treatment. So sometime in um, mid January, I guess. I don't know exactly post -tre -tre treatment. You know how long he would wait if it's a week after, like when he wants to try for that. So hopefully my new insurance will approve that and we'll be good to go there. But we'll have to wait and see what happens. All right, so accomplishments. You probably saw in the um, thumbnail, thumbnail, um, I finished my clo cloche hat. I showed it to Bill. He's like, it looks like a 20s flapper hat. Like so here it is. I don't know if you can see it, the stitching. It's pretty, I like it. The color, again, it was just something I had around the house. Um, and I decided to use it. This is a combination of acrylic and cotton. It's supposed to wash real well, and it's um, it's not quite as itchy as a full acrylic, so hopefully that'll work well. Um, so I, I did include the picture on the thumbnail, um, and I will link to Little John Yarn. Um, it was totally her pattern. I did exactly what she told me to do, and I came up with this hat. So <laughs> I think in her she actually um, accented with a, a couple with an accent color. I think she did green with black stripes. I just chose to do it all in one color. But um, did exactly what she did in her in her pattern. It was lovely. So thank you, Little John Yarns. Um, I today my accomplishments. I created a video. Well, I recorded a video for the robotics team to do their basic hats. So I crocheted another hat. I'm up to fourteen, um, and I'll need to edit that, put it all together for them, and get that out to the students. I did make dinner last night as planned, a little later than I expected, but I did make it. Did you see the text on yesterday's video? I was so proud. It took me like a couple of videos and several tries to get it, but I did it. I did it. I feel so accomplished with the editing software that I was actually able to put text on the screen for you guys. So ta-da! Uh, let's see what else. I did have a doctor's appointment this morning. Um, oh, something else so somewhat significant to report. So my doctor's appointment was nine o'clock this morning. I think I left the house 8.30, quarter to nine. Um, I have been wearing real clothes all day long, including my skinny jeans and have no abdomen pain. So that's something better than I was doing before um, as far as the pressure on the abdomen. So thumbs up. And what else do I have? Oh, I got an angel delivery today. 
I got, they're called Be Strong Pop-Up Cards, so thank you. Um, it's 30 cards, and you pop them open, and they have a lovely quote on inside, and they remind you to be strong and where to find your strength. So I did open one. It was lovely. And if I find any that I really think would be, you know, to share with you guys, I'll share them as we go. So thank you again. And what else can I tell you about today? Oh, so just so you know, <laughs> this is what I'm dealing with. So I was talking to Hoff earlier. And he said to me, I need to rename my videos so that more people will watch them. And his suggestions so far were, watch this video, I'll show you my breasts. But then he says, I won't show them like a naked breasts. I'll just show a video of my breasts and clothes. I'm like, I'm not sure I'm digging that. And then we were talking about my jeans. And I said, well, I like the skinny jeans and they're making my butt look good. Although there's a little bit of um, gap in them. I'm, you know, in a little while, I might have to go down to the skinny, skinny jeans. But for now, I'm happy in the skinny jeans. Um, and he's like, there's another title for your video. My butt look good in these jeans. I'm like, oh, you see what I have to deal with here, folks? <laughs> I will not be naming my videos about body parts. Uh, I might try and spice up the video names in the future. Um, I think the value of the day of name, I might keep the day of name, but maybe include something about, you know, the highlight of the day instead of talking about the re epoch in the title. It's not very exciting. I agree. Um, so in any case, I think that is all the status I have for you today. So again, thank you so much for coming along today. Thank you for your lovely comments yesterday. I, I am, again, feeling well. I'm hoping that this is how I will feel at least this good, if not better. Um, until my next treatment at the end of next week. So I, I'm hoping that I have a week of this kind of feeling pretty good. You know, there's definitely an underlying feeling that it's not quite right, but it's as good as it's going to get. And I'm very grateful um, to have these days where I feel pretty good. So again, thank you all so much for coming along. We love you. Remember, every day is a gift. Live it.